EDK coming up onto the map screen right now. And he's going up against Fred OG. I heard a wolf get called out. I'm excited yeah. to see it. Oh, we're getting a, um, IDK's Pyra Mithra. Right. Yeah. Um, it's going to be a matchup of uh, Mithra trying to get in uh, very close with that you know, much better movement speed and Wolf trying to zone her out with those um, right. disjointed forward airs. Oh, no punish on the far up B. You know, it's one of those things where if you're going... I'm sorry, did he just he, taunt? He just, he just taunted and it hurtbox shifted him, causing him to miss the grab. Wow, okay, that must have been an impact. No, yeah, but I mean, hey, it looked cool doing it. Yeah. Oh, Pyro's coming out pretty early on, but it makes sense. Uh, uh, Wolf having that uh, slower movement and um, a spacey, so easy to combo. Right. And definitely having Pyra with the greater range means that she can kind of outzone Wolf too in the air. Exactly, air. yeah. As long as he gets the right guess, but that neutral B is going to be able to take it from that normal getup. Right. Uh, Fred Dog needs to mix up the way he's approaching and the way he's getting off the ledge. Um, so so scary, especially with both of the characters having very good uh, ledge trapping neutral Bs. Yeah. Great four tilt um, anti air. That's I didn't even notice that, but that's a great uh, anti air move if you can catch the Wolf jumping in. You know, I feel like Fred OG is just throwing out a bunch of hitboxes. He's, he's not he's really trying to get something started. Yeah. Here we go. No, IDK really just kind of playing back. You know, not really committing to anything if he doesn't have to, and you know, just really making Fred OG guess where he's going to attack. Look at that. He like Beautiful bait, side yeah, he baited. B. Yeah, yep. he baited it, and then just managed to get the right punish on it. Here we go. Oh, another side B from Ledge, and Fred. Fred needs to to bring it back here. He's not getting anything started. Naren to forward tilt. I don't think that's going to be able to take it. No two-frame attempt. Oh. Holding shield there. I like that mix-up, but he should have went for down smash. He didn't yeah. grab the ledge, and uh, now he's another ledge trapping situation. Neutral right. B from the ledge going to send Fred OG to the side of the blast zone and up smash. All right, finally taking the stock, but I feel like there were so many ledge trap attempts where he could have just forward tilted and yeah. done even like a simple forward tilt would have put more pressure than what Fred has been doing so far. Exactly. Great Nair covering the switch. Yeah. I honestly would have loved to see another drop zone Nair just to hit Pyra out. Mm -hmm. All this rage is going to really come into handy. Uh, killing them off stage, those nerves are going to send much further at even the lower percent. Right. And yet again, just not doing anything on ledge. I feel like Wolf is one of the few characters who is so deadly when you ledge trap with him. Mm -hmm. And it's like giving up half of your neutral just to not do anything. Oh, I think if he got that, like, the spread out one, he would be able to hit him out of the, the side B. But um, great ledge trapping using the movement speed of uh, Mithra to, to cover most of those options. But supposed Ooh. to be a down smash. Yeah. He's just throwing out these forward smashes, hoping yeah. IDK runs in. Yeah, I feel like he's in that wolf. Oh, forward smash kills. And it's lagless, therefore I can throw it out. Yeah, but that side B is going to be able to two, uh, hit below the ledge and take uh, Fred OG's second stock. Right. No punish on that. He's throwing out hitboxes like out of nowhere, and yeah. he's putting himself in so much end lag, he's unable to whiff punish any of these moves. Oh, nice shine to kind of break it out. But I feel like that was just another pressing the button moment. Yeah, it, hits. Um, IDK looks uh, very good at, at not getting hit by any of this uh, matching of normals. Like there. Yeah. There we go, another aggressive side B to get back to center stage. And I feel like IDK does throw out a move. Oh no, oh, no. that is it. Yeah, he got a little yeah. bit too overzealous off stage. Saw Mithra trying to, uh, sorry, Pyra trying to recover, and he went off stage for it. It was a good attempt, but when is it uh, unable to hit the tech, and he's going to lose the stock for that very early. Yeah, and definitely, I feel like when you neutral B as Pyra like that, that was a free nair for Wolf too. Yeah, definitely. And I feel like he just almost wasn't expecting that, mm -hmm. and so therefore he fast felled into it, and nope, didn't hit the tech button. Yeah. Um, he, he was really confident in that he was going to beat out that hitbox uh, point blank, but he was unable to miss the tech, and um, IDK is going to be taking the first game. It's IDK who took the first game. All right. uh, just cracking the scoreboard, but yeah. no changes from uh, characters. Right. Ooh, going to Cave. Definitely, I like Cave a lot more than Kalos. It feels a lot... I don't know. Like I just like the last ones a little bit better. Oh, what a! That was a very clean conversion off those right. backers into the uppie for percent. Mm, Fred OG. I don't know if these are supposed to be forward tilts or he's just getting out forward smash, but they're getting heavily punished and beautiful uh, reaction tech chase on the platform. Wow, he went really far off stage right. there. Yeah. Pyro is one of those characters where she gets one chance to get to guard you, and you know what? Sometimes if she just catches your landing and she gets that one hit, she needs to kill the stock. Yeah, those moves are so strong. They're a little bit slow, very laggy, but if you can hit them, they'll kill your opponent very early. And Go forward air. He's all over his attempts to get back to center stage. Great neutral B. This ledge trapping is very pristine from IDK. 
Yep. Oh, go. catches no. the landing. Doesn't have a double jump. Is this going to be it? No. No, two frame attempt. He's going to hold yeah. the stage with Pyra. He has so much of a lead. Why go out there and risk it? Right. Great forwarders from Fred OG. He needs to make something start. But what is he forward? He's just forward smashing oh my God. at this point. I, I am crying at this wolf play because. You know, I've seen what Wolf can't. You know what? You know what? It doesn't Earmarks. matter. It doesn't yeah. matter what we say. I, yeah. <laughs> you know uh, what? They say try, try again, and eventually one will hit. Yeah, and I mean, when you got three stocks to work with, one will definitely hit. Yeah. Ooh, there's an error. Ooh, Ooh, that was I, I kind of like the attempt yeah. right there. Missing that spacing on that down air to up air confirm, but IDK is still looking very pretty with this uh, stock lead. Oh, I haven't seen that. He could potentially shine that side B. Right. But unlike other projectiles, it's not a projectile all the way out. It's only a projectile while it's moving. Oh, so, interesting. Okay. So if it stops moving and starts spinning, it's no longer a projectile. Ooh, that laser from the ledge was very risky, and getting hit with that uh, Pyra Neutral B is going to be able to take the stock. But, oh, interesting. It wasn't a true combo there. There we go, throwing out all these nares, hoping that IDK just runs into one of them. But I, he, he's, he's very confident in his space. He said, I don't need to approach. Uh, you're the one that needs to, but that right. switch getting sniped out can be very scary. No uh, two-frame attempt there, but... Oh, I Ooh. thought we were going to see a footstool. I think yeah. he went for the footstool, yeah. I think he got it, he just didn't misspace it. Exactly, yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Oh! Now that was a good forward yeah. smash, punishing the grab. Right. Because at least that time, it wasn't just throwing it out <laughs> yeah. randomly. It was, oh, I'm going to bait out and outspace and range of your grab, and yeah. then I'm going to smash you when you try to grab attempt me. See, that was actually smart, but I feel like he kind of just did that uh, smash just out of habit. What is you he doing? I think maybe it's a little bit of a snapback problem, or he just seems to be throwing out uh, lasers and aerials and forward smashes right. the other direction. I feel like he's in that mood where, like, oh, this is a good button, and not really even paying attention to where his opponent is, you know? Yeah, exactly. Yeah, this is just one good opening from IDK away from getting uh, the stock here, but going for a little bit of a mix-up on that platform can cost him. Good laser beating out the neutral B. I like that instead of going yeah. to uh, try to approach it, he's just uh, shooting it away. Yeah. No, I would love to at least see one attempt at a forward tilt at ledge or down smash. Just something. Oh, oh no! no! He got a wave bounce laser instead of a side B, and that's going to cost him the game. That's so unfortunate. He really came right. into his own there. You know, we saw him do a little bit of a. He's hitting a lot of buttons, but he was able to get that.